Make the next crash as spectacular, Hotshot. Rolling! Good one. Nice hit. Keep it up. Contact! Break him down. Hello, people. Saturn is in the building. Alive and well. I say alive and well, which I'll get into in a few seconds. First off, I want to wish everyone a belated happy Christmas and New Year. I mean, it's almost been a month, but I just thought I'd say this now. But uh, my year started off very crappy-like, and I'll explain now. About a couple days after um, New Year's Day, I saw that my dad was ill, and I thought he said he had a flu jab a couple weeks ago, and it came back with a vengeance, apparently. I thought at first. I was like, okay, hopefully you'll recover in a few days. No, because apparently <laughs> that flu turned out to be the one thing we've all been trying desperately to avoid. Dat boy, <laughs> also known as the text you saw just a few seconds ago. And I was livid. I was annoyed as hell because I was doing the right thing, staying indoors. My family was doing the same. However, my dad had to keep going out again and again because he's a key worker, mind you. Um, I won't specify exactly what he does to be safe, of course. But it was just... I was so mad when I realized that it was Corona, because I was trying my damnedest to avoid it when I was outside, I had a mask on, hand sanitizer with me, but it was to no avail, apparently. To no bloody avail. And I can safely say, as a COVID survivor, it is a bastard to live with <laughs> for at least two weeks, because, um... The symptoms I had were a loss of sense of smell temporarily. It is coming back. Um, taste is still there, so I didn't get to there. Um, pain in my lungs, pain in my chest, a runny nose for a few days, a sore throat for a few days. And that was it. Nothing major. I wasn't coughing up blood or anything. I was fine. But I was still understandably angry because... I th because... It wasn't my parents' fault. They didn't know it was, it was with them this whole time, so I can't really blame them. It's the people that pass it on I have to blame. So here's some tips for you in case you're going out shopping in advance. Take hand sanitizer with you and a face mask, and keep a good distance away from others just to be safe. Because that's what I usually do, but a lot of people don't seem to follow those regulations because they think the virus is fake and I am living proof that it is 
not fake, it is 100% real, and it is painful to live with. So, with that information dispatched, I would like to say thank you all for watching this video, and I do apologize for the staticky sounds in both the Chase event recordings because, well, apparently the headset was not being nice to me, apparently, I don't know. But yeah, thank you all for watching, like and subscribe if you're new, if you want to, and I'll see you guys next time. Take care, and stay safe.